from our most like reliable sense is basically nothing. Yo, shh, we're back for another Shrippum adventure. One Piece set to Paramount War. Almost through this case. Like, not totally, but getting there. There's, I think, gonna be three more boxes for the next three part series. And I've been talking about Qigong the last couple times, so I thought I'd just continue that conversation here. Um, you know, it, it, the, the mind is a really powerful, powerful thing. The, I am a doctor, I'm a dentist, and um, I prescribe drugs and I give people medicine and. One of the things that I've learned and all the things that I've read about these studies and stuff is there's this thing called the placebo effect. And the placebo effect is super real. It's a very, very real thing, which suggests that there's something stronger at work here, bless them, than just the medicine. And I believe that is your mind. And I really think that the more you believe in stuff and the more faith you can put in something, um, the more likely it is to work. Uh, the thing to be careful of is you don't want to be doing something that's potentially detrimental to your health. Obviously, you want to make sure that you're doing safe stuff. If you if you are doing something that is really detrimental to your health, but you've convinced yourself that it's healthy, I'm not sure that that will necessarily pan out as well uh, uh, against other things that you might do. But um, yeah, using using your mind to really believe in something, you know, get behind it, get some information that that you can you can stand with because. The, the basis of science is that we don't understand everything, right? Like it, we provide evidence for the things we believe we understand to change the way that we think about them so we can understand greater things. And I think a big part of that is challenging stuff and thinking, okay, maybe not everything we've seen our whole lives or the things that we've uh, grown accustomed to are actually the way that it works. Like if you, who Kuzan, that's pretty nice. That means there's no ace in this box, but that's that. We still got an alt art. Um, if you, uh, you know, if you ace, there he is. Not the one we're looking for, but that's fine. Uh, if you can really believe in something, you kind of can make it real and make it work. And and there's enough information out there these days where you can kind of bridge the gap between you know like mysticism and spirituality and science in a lot of ways. If you if you think about like what we can actually perceive, you know, the visible light spectrum is like 400 nanometers, which is an insanely, insanely small amount of a massive spectrum saying that like what we actually perceive of our from our most like reliable sense is basically nothing. Like we're, we're basically seeing nothing, but sight is like that's the one that we bank on the most. And another Kuzan, double Kuzan box, and you see it just like that. So, you know, question stuff and don't just take everything for what it is. I think that's a it's a helpful, healthy way to live. And, the more you believe that you don't know everything about something, the more you can actually learn about that thing. And learning is awesome. So I hope that helps. And I hope this is a fun series talking about the mind. Thank you. Gozaimasu. And I'll see y'all next time. Please, do you like my video? Please comment. Tell me what you think. Do you like my bandana?